Hey Pen Adventures, welcome back to my channel. I hope everyone's having an amazing day. This is your glamorous Penny Pincher Shalomi, and today I'm coming to you with a living room refresh fall style. So if you want to see what I've done and where I got all my items, you know exactly what to do. Just keep on watching. Okay guys, so I'm going to take you in and give you a quick look around of what it looks like. And then I'll take you closer and show you all the items that I've added. Okay guys, we're gonna go over and start with the coffee table. You guys know this coffee table very well. I've had it for many years. I'm trying to change it, but you guys keep saying, don't change the table, I love it. So it's here for you again. And on top of it, I have this tray again, this tray too, I've had it for years and I absolutely love it. It works pretty much with everything and so it's hard for me to kind of switch things up. So here I have this beautiful vase. I got this vase at HomeSense. It is a Z Gallery do because I do remember going to Z Gallery and seeing this vase there. And so I was too happy to see it in uh, Home Goods for a fraction of the price that Z Gallery had. In here I have some um, black pompous grass. These came from Timu. And in the tray, I have some pumpkins, these two black ones here with the little lights in them are super cute. I got those from the Dollar Tree last fall. And I do believe if I'm not mistaken that this tiny one also came from the Dollar Tree. So that is what's in the tray. And then just moving over to the side of that, I have my mirrored candlesticks. And then moving down, I have this beautiful gold pumpkin that I brought with me from Toronto. They came from HomeSense. Uh, the candlesticks also came from HomeSense in Toronto. Okay, moving from the table, I'm gonna take you to the sofa. And you can see, guys, that I do have traditional fall colors. Now, you guys know that I'm not a traditional fall color girl. But hey, I wanted to do something different this time. I guess I feel like a little bit traditional. So here we go. For all my traditional folks, for all my traditional family members, this one is especially for you. All right, so the first thing I did was I added this black throw. I've had this throw for many years. Guys, don't get rid of your stuff. Fold them, put them away, because you never know when you may need to use it again instead of going every five minutes to buy new items. Here I have a mixture of uh, pillows, this beautiful orange one, gold and black. Now these I got from Amazon. And you guys already know what I do. I buy pillow covers. I don't buy pillows anymore. And I just switch them out. These are um, 22 inches. They are nice and big. Just like I like it because my sectional is super big. So I have that on the end. And then in the corner um, of the sectional, I went again with one of the orange uh, pillows and gold i don't have a black one here but i want you to know that these um ones are uh older ones and they are smaller i think these are 18 inches i've had these for a very long time and i just kind of paired it with the 22 inch gold i mean the 22 inch orange one right there and what I did on the other end was I did the very same thing, which is to go with the three large ones, orange, gold, and black, as you can see here. On this end though, I did not use a throw. I think that the one throw in the other corner is more than enough to, you know, add that elegance and add a little, you know, razzle dazzle to the space. So I just went with one.
okay guys so from the side of the sofa let's look at this side of the room you guys already know these two accent chairs i brought them over with me i got this beautiful um painting when i got here this came from ross and every time i show it in a video it looks super small it is huge okay it couldn't even hold in my truck but it does not come off as big on um camera i'm not sure why and then below it i just have two uh lanterns these came from home goods and i just added a couple of candles in them and on the chairs i have these beautiful um pillows again these are pillow covers from amazon and i had these um in here for a while like the um these pillow covers because this is the normal color for um, my living room as you can see black white gold or black um, off white and gold and then i did the same thing in the other chair so again just a, a section with extra seating here right across from where i have the sofa Okay guys, let's move over to the built-ins. So for the built-ins, I didn't change a whole lot. Um, I still have the same items that I've always had there, but what I did was I added a few pieces. As you can see here, I added a small pumpkin. That pumpkin came from the Dollar Tree a few years ago. And I added this um, other one here. I think I may have gotten this one at Target last year in their dollar spot. And I just, you know, brought the color from the sofa with the nice burnt orange to, you know, tie the room together. And this pearl, beautiful pearl one I've had for many years. And I just have it sitting on like the ledge of the built-in. Let's move over to the other side. On this side, I added another beautiful pumpkin. I also brought this one with me from Toronto. And then I just added another gold pumpkin here to match the other side and just have this other beautiful one um, leaning against this vase. So that is it for the built-ins. Okay, so the fireplace, guys, I've always had this vase here with these beautiful picks that I picked up from Michael's last year. And I love the shape of this vase. At one point it was orange, like way back in the day, maybe seven, eight years ago. And I spray painted it gold. I may spray paint it a matte black. Let me know what you think about that. It is huge and it is absolutely gorgeous. Like I'm thinking of taking it out of the gold and doing a matte black. Let me know what you guys think. And guys, these things, they shed a lot. You can see here they keep falling down on the vase that is not dust guys that is actually the um like the little fur the little lint things from these picks but i still love them they're super super gorge all right moving over to the side guys i have these Two beautiful lanterns that I purchased from Home Goods last week. The bigger one was $19.99. The smaller one was $16.99. Absolutely gorgeous. And if I just move over just a tad, I have these beautiful accent um, table here. This accent table, guys, I can also use it as a planter because it's open on the other side. And this beautiful... Um, horse sculpture i got both of these items from ross so guys in the middle of filming i decided to make a change and what i did was i moved the little accent table in between the two accent chairs by the painting let me know what you guys think do you prefer this in this space or do you prefer it with um both of the lanterns let me know i'm not sure which one i like yet maybe i have to get used to having the table here but it it works it absolutely works but let me know you guys thoughts you guys know i love to hear from you so make sure that you leave me a comment in the comment section and just let me know whether or not you prefer the table 
or the lanterns in this space. Okay, guys, this is all I have for you today. Thank you so much for joining me. I truly do appreciate you taking the time to spend some time with me. And if this is your first time seeing my channel, welcome, 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 welcome. I appreciate you clicking on this video and would love for you to join the Penny Pincher family. It's real simple, guys. Just hit the subscribe button below and make sure you click that notification bell as well. That way you never miss an upload. And to my lovely penny pinchers, you know exactly how I feel. Love you, love you, love you, love you, love you. Until the next video, this is your glamorous penny pincher Shalom is saying bye-bye.